Well, we know it's a new year, but some folks are dealing with the same problems. Floridians are working to get themselves out of the unemployment maze. However, they keep getting stuck on a few of the same issues. Yeah, some of the issues they've been having since 2020. Leah Shields is tracking the big three things you need to know about our state's unemployment system in 2022, whether you are back to work or not. Good morning. If you need to reach someone to help you with your unemployment benefits this morning, the service line is back open as of 8 a.m. That number is 1-833-FL-APPLY. It was closed during the extended holiday weekend. Now for the three things you need to know about Florida's unemployment system this year. One, overpayments is still a thing. That's where the state says, oops, we overpaid you. Can you give us that money back? Well, right now, if you don't pay them, eventually you will be sent to collections. However, the other issue that appeals are being delayed. So community activist Vanessa Brito and our expert here at First Coast News, she tells me that a lot of these overpayments aren't actually necessary. You know, people can prove that they weren't actually overpaid. However, when they appeal, they're really stuck in this limbo process for a while. And the third thing Brito says is that they are trying to get a reform bill passed in Florida to help fix the unemployment system. It's a shame that after two years that we're kind of in the same place and that people I think are even more desperate now because when we started, folks hadn't lost anything and they had lost their jobs, you know, but they hadn't lost their homes or had their cars repossessed and their credit was still intact. Now, hopefully you're back at work and maybe you haven't even logged into your Connect account in quite some time. But if you need to file taxes this year, you'll need to get that 1099 G form from the Connect website. If you haven't logged in a while, there is a multi-factor verification process called ID.me. It might take a little maneuvering to figure out. So you want to get logged in sooner rather than later. Leah Shields, First Coast News on your side.